really doesn't matter if you're into your sandy bays or your rocky coves. We've got it all in Guernsey. I thoroughly recommend people to come here for a sea swimming adventure. One of my favourite swims for a sunrise is Marble Bay. It's really off the beaten track. You meander down many little pathways and the beauty just opens up before you. It's a real hidden gem in Guernsey. You're really going to have peace and quiet down here. It really is worth the effort of coming down to Marble Bay. Havelet, on the other hand, is a real social bay. It's in the hob of our town. For me, it's my lunchtime swim. The feel of getting in, it's just a complete reset. You just get such a buzz. We regularly have nine to 10 meter tides here, so the currents are quite strong, but in the bays, particularly along the shoreline, it's very safe so I'd always encourage people to give it a go. A sunset is best observed on the west coast of Guernsey. The whole area is called Grand Havre, but it's made up of about five bays. I would recommend getting in touch with some of the local swimming groups. We have a wide variety of swimming groups in Guernsey. There's nothing like a local for knowing their own water. So the essentials for sea swimming, check all the tides, something to keep your head warm, some goggles to see through, your towel, maybe a cup of coffee. Oh, don't forget your bathers, that would be embarrassing. <laughs>